Yo, what's up everybody? This is Patrick and I am back with another video. And I just wanted to be talking about that Jesus was not white, he was a black man. And I know this is going to offend a lot of you racist um, Christians out there, man, but it's, it's true, man. I mean, I'm not going to lie, white people are racist, man. Seriously, seriously, I was in that boat. I mean, white people are racist, but... I'm not I'm not sticking up for you know, I'm not kissing butt here, but I'm just saying that Jesus was not white. He was a black man. He was a black man. I got proof to back this stuff up, man. And I'm just saying, man, I see white Jesus all over the churches, white Jesus all over the walls and Jesus wasn't white, man. You preach and you and you preachers know that. You preachers know he wasn't white. You're afraid to stick up for the true Jesus Christ? Are you serious, man? What are you doing? You're just wasting your time, man. I mean, if you're not going to preach the true gospel, I mean, you might as well just sell your soul to Satan, man. You ain't fooling God. But anyways, I'm coming just to tell you people, man, that Jesus was not white. He was a black man. And uh, a lot of people do not know this, man, because this is just a lie that's been going around. And I know preachers read this stuff, but they don't want to talk about how Jesus was black. They don't want to talk about G how Jesus had a rejecting image. They don't want to talk about that. They want to make Jesus white. You can't make Jesus white. He wasn't white. You can't you can't make Jesus white. You can't. You can't make Jesus Japanese. You can't make Jesus Chinese. You can't make Jesus Mexican. Jesus was black. He was black. When he walked the world, he was a black man. And I got proof to back this stuff up. I'm in the book of Daniel, chapter 7, verse uh, 9 through, uh, just verse 9. And it says, I beheld, so the thrones were cast down, and the Ancient of Days did sit, whose garment was white as snow. I know you Christians do not get that mixed up. It said garment, white as snow. It didn't say his skin was white as snow. And the hair of his head like the pure wool. Wooled hair. White people don't have wooled hair. Who has wooled hair? Black people. Black people have wooled hair. Or he could be Middle Eastern, but there's no way he's a white man. There's no way. Okay, hair like pure wool. His thrones were like the fiery flame. His throne was like fire. Can you imagine that? And his wheels is burning fire. Burning fire. I mean, these people were rolling with Jesus, man. They know what this dude looked like, man. Daniel, this is Daniel. He was talking about what Jesus looked like in this scripture right here. He was describing what Jesus looked like. And then here it is again, Daniel chapter 10, verse 5 through 6. Then I lifted up my eyes and looked, and behold, a certain man clothed in linen, whose loins were girded with fine gold. His body also was like the burial, and his face is the appearance of lightning, and his eyes as lamps of fire. He didn't have colored eyes. His eyes were lamps of fire, and his arms and his feet like in color to polished brass. His arms and feet colored to colored, I mean, was polished brass. Brass is not white. Brass is not white. Come on. And the voice of his words like the voice of multitude. And then here it is again. Revelation chapter 1 verse 13 through 15. And in the midst of the seven candlesticks, one like unto the Son of Man, clothed with a garment down to the foot and girt about the paps of the golden girdy. His head and his hairs were white like wool. He had wooled hair, but it was white wooled hair. As white as snow, and his eyes were as a flame of fire. And his feet like unto fine brass, as if they burned in a furnace. And his voice as the sound of many waters. The sound of many. Jesus doesn't have accents like we have. There's many different voices, man. I'm in the book of Revelation chapter 2 verse 18. And it says, And to the angel of the church in Thyria write the words of the Son of God, the words of the Son of God, who has eyes like a flame of fire, and whose feet are like burnished bronze. Man, I just proved to you people, I had tons of scriptures on that, burnished bronze, man, whose feet are like burnished bronze. I mean, and then right here, Revelation chapter 1, verse 13, I read it to you already. And his feet like unto fine brass, as if they burned in a furnace. What happens to something when it burns up? It turns black. Put something, put stuff in a fireplace, it turns black. 
burnished bronze. Like if they were burned in a furnace. He was black, man. Jesus Christ was not white. He was a black man. And I know I'm probably offending a lot of you people out there. Well, I can't accept this, Patrick. Well, you better start accepting. You better start. Because he was not white. He was a black man. Seriously. Man, this is deep. I, need, I, I used to think Jesus was white. I didn't know he was black. And preachers, the preachers know this stuff too. They don't want to say this stuff. They don't want to offend anybody. But I'm not here to be accepted by the world. I'm just here to tell the truth, man. I'm just here to tell. I'm telling the truth, man. I mean, come on, man. Just, just tell the truth, man. But anyways, man, I, I just wanted to show y'all that Jesus was not white. He was a black man. I love you people, and I hope this video blessed y'all. And I just, you know. This stuff is really real, man. It's, it's it's not a game. It's not no Looney Tunes story, man. It's Illuminati stuff. This, stu this stuff is real, man. We are in the last days. I mean, time is running out. I mean, God's word is uh, it's really, really true, man. It really, really is, man. Time is running out. But anyways, man, I love you people, and uh, I'll see y'all later.